When you injure your skin, your tissues become inflamed and bacteria can find their way in. This attracts white blood cells called macrophages. They engulf the bacteria to remove them from your body. Let's zoom in on the cell membrane to see what happens next. Receptors in the cell membrane are waiting for a signal. That signal is a cytokine, a molecule released during inflammation. The cytokine binds to the receptors. This triggers a series of events that transmit the signal into the cell. This initiates signal transduction, resulting in activation of transcription factors. The transcription factor diffuses through the cytoplasm, recruiting nuclear import proteins along the way. It enters the cell nucleus through a nuclear pore. The nuclear import proteins are dislodged. The transcription factor binds to a gene in the DNA that codes for digestive enzymes that need to be produced by the cell. This binding initiates transcription. In transcription, a copy of the gene is made and this copy is called messenger RNA or mRNA. Proteins interact with the mRNA. Their job is to remove non-coding regions called introns. Nuclear export proteins bind to the mRNA. The mRNA leaves the nucleus through a nuclear pore. The mRNA is now in the cytoplasm. A ribosome assembles around the mRNA. It reads the mRNA code and recruits amino acids to build a polypeptide. This process is called translation. A protein binds to the growing polypeptide chain. This protein directs the ribosome to dock at the surface of the rough endoplasmic reticulum. Translation resumes and the polypeptide is transferred into the lumen of the endoplasmic reticulum. An oligosaccharide is attached to the polypeptide, creating a glycoprotein. A vesicle buds from the surface of the endoplasmic reticulum, carrying its cargo of freshly made glycoproteins. The vesicle is carried towards the Golgi apparatus along one of the cell's structural girders known as the cytoskeleton.
Many vesicles are arriving at the Golgi, dropping off their protein cargo. The proteins move through the stacks of the Golgi apparatus, where they are modified. These modified proteins are digestive enzymes. They are packaged into organelles called lysosomes and transported to the area in the cell where the bacterium is being held. The bacterium is held captive in a phagosome. Membranes fuse. The digestive enzymes enter the phagosome and destroy the bacterium. The digested bacterium is discarded by exocytosis.